Nine months into the pandemic, more than 55 million cases around the world of COVID-19. More than a million people have succumbed to the disease. The World Health Organization's latest briefing came as after Moderna said that its experimental vaccine is now 94.5% effective in preventing COVID-19. Last week, remember, Pfizer announced that its vaccine is also more than 90% effective. COVID-19 vaccine is on the horizon. But the WHO Director General Ted Ross says that while he is cautiously optimistic about the vaccine, this is not the time for complacency. Listen in. This is not the time for complacency. While we continue to receive encouraging news about COVID-19 vaccines and remain cautiously optimistic about the potential for new tools to start to arrive in the coming months, Right now, we are extremely concerned by the surging cases we are seeing in some countries, particularly in Europe and the Americas. Health workers and health systems are being pushed to the breaking point. This is a dangerous virus which can attack every system in the body. Those countries that are letting the virus run unchecked are playing with fire. First. There will be further needless deaths and suffering. Second, as we featured two weeks ago in a press conference, we are seeing a significant number of people experiencing long-term effects of the virus. Third, health workers in particular are facing extreme mental health pressure and cases are severely burdening health systems in too many countries.